Hey guys, what's up? It's Fragile. Welcome to today's video. So today is Record Store Day Black Friday. Happy Record Store Day Black Friday. So Record Store Day Black Friday is the same thing as Record Store Day, but on Black Friday. There are a few records I am planning on picking up. So let's head to Zia and see what we got. Alright guys, so we are here at Zia Records for a Record Store Day Black Friday. So let's hop out the car and get these records that we've been wanting. Alright everyone, we are back here in the car from picking up our releases from Record Store Day Black Friday. I picked up two out of the three that I did want. I found out the third one that I did want, the Record Store Day Black Friday pressing of Meteora by Linkin Park was cancelled last minute. I'm really super bummed, I really wanted that, but it was cancelled so you know, what can you do? Yeah, that was supposed to be pressed on aqua blue vinyl, it was supposed to look so cool. But anyway, we picked up two records. It's time to head back home and go over what we got today. Hey, hey guys, I have returned home from Zia Records. We got our bag of records from Record Store Day Black Friday. Let's head inside and go over what I got. All right, we are back from Zia Records. Support your local businesses, support your local record stores. Now the two records we did pick up today for Record Store Day Black Friday, starting off here with Crown the Empires, 07102010, or July 10th, 2010. Now, this is Crown the Empires' acoustic album released exclusively for Record Store Day. It is pressed on neon orange vinyl, as you can see on the tag. Now, that album title, 07102010, or July 10th, 2010, marks the band's inception, as that is the very first show they played. And this album, 07102010, is acoustic renditions of all of their tracks throughout their entire career, spanning from 2010 to today. So let's go ahead and open this. 
Yeah, I only picked up two records today. The third record that we were going to pick up, which was Linkin Park's Meteora, pressed on aqua blue vinyl. They canceled it last minute, I was told. So there's that. All right. We have opened the Crown the Empire record. I'd see this neon orange. Is there a download code? There is no download code. Get it out of the cheap sleeve. It is just pressed on a solid neon orange record with a white center label. Looks pretty dope. Looks pretty dope. And here on side B, it does have a black center label and more neon orange goodness. And the last record I did pick up was none other than the Record Store Day Black Friday pressing of My Chemical Romance's Life on the Murder Scene. This is the very first pressing of Life on the Murder Scene by My Chemical Romance. Now, Life on the Murder Scene is Three Cheers for Sweet Revenge by My Chemical Romance with live tracks blended in as well. There's a different play here on the album art where the people are actually real. They're not animated characters like they are on the Three Cheers for Sweet Revenge album. And here's the back with the track listing. There's the, the husband and wife. Now, a little bit different of a sleeve here. We got the dude on this side. We got the half face. Perfect, perfect. And here's the back with the track listing and the dead bride here. And this record, this record is pressed on clear with red splatter. I think it looks so good. Clear with red splatter. Nice touch, ni nice touch. It does look like blood. So this is my second record store day pickup from my chemical romance i did pick up their pressing last year on record store day of 2019 of the black parade is dead which is their live album of the black parade So that will conclude today's video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did enjoy, drop a like on this video. Subscribe for more records. Follow my Twitch channel. Link down below for Music Monday Record of the Week. And we'll see you here next time.